welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a brand new video. We've got an Amazon must-haves today. I am so happy to be filming this video. Firstly, because I love Amazon. We are Amazon Prime people. We shop it probably way too much and Amazon knows me way too well because it recommends me all the amazing things that I just purchased, purchased, purchased. But secondly, I have also asked you guys over on Instagram what your must-haves are so that I could get them, to share them with the rest of you and also try them out myself. So yeah, I've got some amazing finds that I cannot wait to share with you. So make sure if you haven't already to subscribe, like this video if you're a fan of the Amazon hauls and of course, without further ado, make sure you pause this video and go grab yourselves a nice cozy drink, put your feet up, relax and let's get into it. Before sharing with you my Amazon purchases, I do very kindly have a sponsor for today's video, HelloFresh. My faves, my absolute faves. I love HelloFresh. It is, if you've never heard of it before, which I would be so surprised if you'd never heard of it before, but it's a subscription food service, which essentially delivers meals straight to your door, hassle-free, no need to browse at the supermarkets, no need to make that never-ending decision of what we're having for dinner tonight. You can log on to the platform and select your meals for the week. Now, we personally have the meal for two people. You can have it for, for more. And we have three meals per week. Again, you can have more. I do sometimes throw in a lunch option as well or a brunch, whatever they have with sides and specials. I actually had yesterday the tuna avocado salad, which was delicious. They had a kind of like basil pesto dressing with it, which I've never had before. It was delicious. And then also last night, what did we have last night? Oh, we had the beef empanadas, if I'm saying that right. Again, a very me meal, love a pastry meal. And the fact that they had it with the side salad, it was just a nice addition. So yeah, delicious options for you to choose if you're more calorie conscious, if you prefer vegetarian options, if you want the quick, easy, 20 minute rapid type meals, or you want the more wholesome, longer cooking process, totally tailored to you and your lifestyle, it's so easy. And I do also have a discount code for you guys, which is Freya Farrington, which will get you 50% off your first box, 35% off your next three, which is amazing, well worth taking advantage of. So I will leave that in the description box below, along with a link for you to start HelloFresh today. So thank you, of course, to them for very kindly sponsoring today's video. Now let's get into the haul and where shall we start? I feel like it was a finally time to invest in a new steamer. I've heard good things about the brand Steamery. Firstly, the actual branding and the quality of the products is amazing. If you're an aesthetic and a steeth, steeth, like I am, you like the look of things, or you like things to look nice, um, then I feel like if you've never heard of the brand Steamery before, then you will love it. I've actually got a few things. Seeing as though we're so close to being down in the basement and having my utility of dreams, my little utility with dog wash station, um, utility cupboards, washer dryer in there. I'm so excited. So I'm going to have the cupboards neat and tidy and looking nice too. And yeah, they're going to include my new steamer. So this is what the actual steamer is like. Now I can't give a review of how it works because I'm yet to try it. I have freshly received this today. So yeah, it's brand new, fresh in the packaging, looks lovely. Cannot wait to give it a try. I probably will let you guys know over on, like in within one of my vlogs or something, how I get on with that. But it does come in different colors. I just opted for the plain and simple black. And it was, let me see how much this was. I think they've got like a mini travel one at about 50 pounds. Yeah, the black, full size one like that. I think they even do one on a stand, but more expensive. That one was 110 pounds. They do have blue, gray, and pink as well. The blue one's a little bit cheaper, 10 pounds cheaper. In fact, the pink one's only 84.99. There you go, if you're a pink girl. I'm so excited to try that. I can't believe I'm saying, I'm so excited to try a steamer, but I honestly am. I just feel like it's gonna make things a lot easier for when I do do any kind of fashion content. So yes, that is my first purchase and my most expensive one. So I feel like it makes sense to show you the other two bits that I got from Steamery as well. So again, on the whole laundry um, aesthetic vibe, I got some tumble dryer balls. Now I saw the, uh, well I've seen these all over to be honest with you, not just from Steamery, but I figured Steamery are like such a lovely brand that I figured I would try the good ones. Now we are, 
yet to have a tumble dryer as soon as we've got the utility um, cabinets kind of installed downstairs, which won't be long. Who knows by the time this video has been uploaded, will they be in? They might have arrived, they might not be installed yet. So they will have arrived actually, um, which is very exciting. Then we're gonna get, we're gonna move our washer dryer into the utility and then we're gonna get a new tumble dryer. So any recommendations on good tumble dryers, let me know. Um, but yeah, I got these for that. You literally just throw them in with your wash. Economical and sustainable option to fabric softener and plastic dryables. They cut drying time by up to 50% and also remove static, which is good. They last a lifetime. I also picked up their lint brush. I feel like if you're a pet owner, a lint brush of some kind is probably in most rooms, cars, however, wherever and whenever you're with your dog, especially the golden retriever dog, um, you need a lint roller. They are your best friend. So this one I thought was really cool. So basically it, has this function which whereby you turn it round, the lint um, gatherer type thing, I was gonna do it on my sleeves, I ain't got any sleeves on. You just gather up the lint, it all collects here, then you twist it a few times to clean it off and then pop the lid open and all your lint will be left in here that you can literally just tip out and throw in the bin. So I love the look of it again, just a nice looking one to have out, just handy in the utility room very handy an absolute must and this one looks nice too at the time of filming this those tumble dry balls are actually on offer at 15.99 from 22 pounds and that lint roller is 14 pounds so it is expensive for a lint roller but if it works well lasts forever it's a win from me fully justifying my purchases here but i'm sure some of you will appreciate a worth that little bit extra spending that's all I'm going to say, because I, I do find sometimes with cheap lint rollers, the amount of lint paper I have to go through, and that doesn't require any refill of lint paper, so in the long run it's cheaper, that's how I'm going to say it. Another recent purchase, I don't actually have it with me, it's downstairs, but uh, you may have seen it in our trip to Italy recently, I picked up a new um, suitcase, like a handheld luggage suitcase for the one that you can put on the plane. That is like a brown and cream color. I really like the look of it. It was 45 pounds. I'm gonna try and start up a Amazon storefront maybe. Hopefully by the time this video goes live, I will have looked into that, but I need to teach myself how to do it first. Next up, I have an absolute summer essential. It is a handheld fan if you're anything like me. The heat and I just don't work well together unless I've got a swimming pool or the ocean to jump in because otherwise I just, the hot, clammy, sticky, it's just not me. So this, I, <laughs> I decided to pick up this. I just thought it'd be handy with it being quite slim to just throw in a handbag. I don't know if you'll be able to hear that. It's got three settings. One, two, three. And let me tell you, this is fairly powerful. I'm enjoying this. They did have it in white. I think they had like pink and blue, other colors as well. I just really like this neutral color. So yeah, pick this up an absolute summer essential and it was a 15 pounds. But let me tell you, it works. It's USB charged as well. So you don't need loads of batteries. You can just charge it whenever you need to. So in my little question box that I did asking you guys what your Amazon must-haves are, a lot of you said coffee table books, which like me, if you've seen my previous Amazon hauls, I pretty much feature a coffee table book in every single one because A, they're cheaper and B, they just have everything. So I decided to get my hands on another one. I was actually just gonna show you this one first. I didn't actually pick this up from Amazon. I picked this up from Costco, but they do have it on Amazon. That's where I first initially saw it. It's the new Tom Ford 002 book. So if you've got the black one, 001, then it's quite nice to have the matching duo. And then I also picked up this, which Having been to Italy recently, this was recommended by Amazon on my recommendations on, on the homepage. So I picked it up. The main reason why I love this is actually the binder, if you can see there. Let me take it out, it's packaging actually. It says it's a Venetian cookbook of sorts. It retails for 26 pounds. I loved the cover of it and the um, color of it is, I don't know if it's gonna pick up on camera. It's a very, very pale, almost beige green. And then the binder has green threading on it as well, which you guys know I'm loving green. It's also got gold as well as the foil on the front and the back. 
so it's quite nice that it kind of goes with the aesthetic the home decor future kitchen etc this is going to be maybe even one that we have out on display i mean just leave it on the page with the bread i didn't pay 26 pounds for it let me see how much i did pay for it prices do vary though don't they with amazon i'll tell you a price now it might be less by the time you're watching this video or it might be more it was, I paid for it, um, £17. I feel like another Amazon Essentials must-haves for a lot of people is new phone cases, laptop cases, of which I got one of each. I've got a new laptop recently, so I decided to get myself a new case for it. This is so lovely. Well, anyway, let's start with the phone case. I just got a plain black silicone one. This one that I got is from Etsy. I've got the black phone, so I thought we could switch out and just pop on brand new case and I thought I'd just stick with black so there we go brand new phone case this is the brand does it say make the case make the case and then for laptop I picked up a uh, kind of like a stone mauve taupe I'm gonna say a taupe color case so it is matte this has just got the cover on it um but it's got the bottom part as well with the fan um, gaps, the little protectors here. And what I didn't realise is that this also comes with a keyboard protector, a protect your privacy webcam cover, and then also a track pad protector. I think that was about £15 that case, but everything that comes with it as well, I thought that was pretty good value for money. I've got a couple of kitchen bits. Firstly, these little two-pack, or not really a two-pack, but a set of oven mitt silicone things i just figured i don't know about you but with an oven glove right it can get a bit fiddly to try and get the um things out the oven i thought these would be far more handy and just really easy to use so yeah i picked them up in again they had different colors i just went for the kind of like stone color just nice and neutral nice and simple apricot pink they call them oh they do a lovely green like a nice sage green color a dark charcoal gray and a red they are 6.99 each moving on i also got again i suppose for the kitchen it's actually more for when we no longer have our kitchen in use which is for me filming this video within days so by the time i'm uploading it it's probably ooh, already done now we still have a kind of kitchen of sorts we won't have any kitchen waste which means no washing machine no sink waste no dishwasher waste um so yeah basically without kitchen we'll have fridge freezer plugged in but as soon as the basement's done we're moving straight down there and we'll just get like a little mini fridge freezer um well quite a big freezer i think a mini fridge to get us by we've got our microwave and stuff like that down there that we can have but until we've built our new kitchen we will be without a hob and an oven but anyway i also in the meantime have picked up some disposable stuff just for ease and convenience with us not having the sink to wash things up in i just picked up some of these sugarcane 96 bowls i also picked up some organza ribbon this like two pack it came with the um a lovely kind of rich forest green and a nice jute so i thought these would be appropriate for seasonal occasions easter christmas that kind of thing but also just for birthdays all year round two rolls of burlap fabric craft ribbon that's what they call it burlap and for the set of two it was 7.99 next up i picked up this white dispenser box in black they did have other colors i was tempted for the white one actually i don't know why i opted for the black in the end but i did um and they do other colors as well it's kind of like a matte finish and all you do is just pop in here the wipes that you are using whether it be baby wipes in a nursery to have out kind of on the side without it just being like looking a bit messy having just some baby wipes out on the side and um, i was thinking of putting this either in with barney's bits because i always have some wipes for him like some dog friendly wipes just to wipe his paws or whatever if needs be um and also i thought about maybe putting it in our kitchen cleaning cupboard or with um you know some like cleaning wipes could even pop them in other rooms so that you've got them to hand it's seven pounds how much was it seven pounds 79 yeah this is another super practical purchase and it is these little black hooks it's a pack of 
30 and you simply pop these over the hanger to have more space to be able to hang up more things firstly these hangers as well you can get these from amazon i'll leave some links they are so handy they're very very small i have all of my hangers are the exact same black with the silver top velvet hangers you can get them from tk maxx costco wherever but amazon have them as well and because they're velvet and so thin they take up no room and the clothes don't fall off which is great so you just pop this over here and just have it sat like so so then you have this section which has the little hook which you can hang another hanger on and the clothes kind of um sit just slightly lower so it just allows for you to hang more things they're only four pounds okay so for my chloe bag if you've seen it it is like a tote it's called the woody tote bag and it's completely open it's quite big so good like beach bag or um shopping tote style bag where you can or, or need to carry a laptop whatever you need that is quite chunky to be able to put in there it's good however because it doesn't have any zipper closure or anything like that it always feels a bit like oh if i've just thrown my phone in there or my little card holder or camera or something that people could just swipe it so i picked up this bag organizer which has different sections three different sections in we're actually classes itself as having 18 different sections with all of these inserts on the sides um, but yeah three zippable closure sections which i just think is going to be so handy to be able to throw in my purse keys card holder like i said everything that i just feel needs a bit more security then i've got that option to just put them in there seems to have just gone out of stock i've got it in black still at 8 99 but i think i paid about 6 99 for mine i am saving the best purchase till last i will just say that but we've only got a couple more left to go so i got this set of how many eight piece eight piece set of latte spoons that are matte black these latte spoons are good for lattes but also cocktails they're good for desserts like an ice cream sundae and then i also got this now i got this for my car got a new car coming very soon and i thought this would be nice to pop in there it's one of these portable ones to be honest with you i saw the neon one for 50 quid and then i saw this one for a lot cheaper how much is it 11 pounds so you know couldn't say no um it does look like so it just sits nicely in your cup holder and then the diffuser the oil comes out of here so um it's just usb chargeable as well okay so let's share with you a brand new discovery that thank you to one of you girls who very kindly recommended the what are they called cozy rain cozy rain leggings i opted for a capri style i actually got two now i got two in different brands because i thought i'd try them out the only thing that was was like holding me back a little bit with the cozy rain ones was the fact that they came in one size that i was doubtful for however i read all of the reviews oh, okay not all of them because there were hundreds most of the reviews well okay not even most of the reviews what i'm talking about I read probably the top 10 to 20 reviews and was focusing on people saying about sizing and they were dubious of the one size um someone who was a size eight said they fit me perfectly someone who was a size 14 said they fit me perfectly so i do think they give a lot they are very stretchy and they're not sheer i mean holding them up like this i can kind of see through them but i've tried them on i've done the scott test i'm really really happy with them i wouldn't say they compare exactly to my lululemon leggings which i love however these are a fraction of the price i'm talking five to ten pounds comparison to the 88 pounds from lululemon so for like a workout capri style legging i decided to stock up on two now i wasn't sure with this being a different brand and it had different details on sizing i actually went for the plus size on this other brand the labeling the packaging they came in everything was identical so even though the branding looked different it's the same brand i would definitely say actually that the one size fit me better i actually have one other thing totally forgot to share this with you so this is lydia from fashion influx she recommended these on her stories on instagram i decided to purchase them they're basically like a um ear ring hugger style earrings so they just add a little something extra if you've not got piercings up your ears it's kind of hard to see but that's what they look like there's i think three or four different styles and you get a pair in each so you can wear matching in your ears but 
This is just one design and you pop this bit through your earlobe hole and then this bit just hooks on top of your ear cuff. So it sits like that, but that goes through your ear. If that's any help as to what it will look like, just ignore the fact that I've got like a little huggy in at the bottom, but that bit going through your ear, that is exactly how you wear them. Again, these are about six, five or six pounds, super affordable, so I'll leave them linked too. So thank you to you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thanks to HelloFresh for kindly sponsoring today's video. Don't forget to take advantage of that discount code Freya Farrington, which will get you 50% off your first box and 35% off your next three boxes, which is amazing. Try it out, cancel any time. So if you decide it's not for you, that's fine. You can also pause it. So if you're away on holiday or anything like that, again, pause easy so convenient and so recommended so thanks to them for working with me on today's video i hope you guys have enjoyed it thumbs up if you did and i hope to see you all very very soon in my next video bye guys